Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. Last time, we finished up with Anubis' tower, found out that Horus is trying to kill us, and then freed some people from this palace. The Cursed Palace, to be exact. We actually freed this man here, the short guy. And uh, there was another man we freed as well. Now, uh, and they need to get back to their farm, but they can't really get there because there are those evil Eye of Ra on the way. However, if we use the Eagle Stone here... Well, I'll, I'll show in a second. Uh, let's fly on over here. Now, uh, before we do anything, though, I actually want to, um... I want to go... Finds. I want to go capture something before we do that. Um, I want to go get a slim burble. Now, I could use it for here and to destroy this platform and make that boulder probably fall down and destroy some eye of raw. But I, uh, I want a slim burble from the museum, and I just want to get that now before I forget. We'll come up. We'll come back up here um, afterwards. We'll just fly on over here. Look at all those holes. Someone's been digging quite a lot of holes. Was that a treasure chest up there? How interesting. Um, anyway, where are these slim burbles? I remember them being somewhere down here. If I could find them. Um, where's their little hidey hole? Their little nook? There it is, hidden by the pot. Give me some scarabs. Yep, there it is, horrible little monster. Uh, he's automatically, like, able to capture those, so, uh, there, we got a slim burble. I wanted to make sure you get one of those, just don't want to forget about him. Now, let's go back to the Eagle Stone. By the way, off-screen, I did some research on Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy, and I found out that there were actually- ooh, odd and I. Um, but I actually found out that, th that there were a lot of, like, things cut out of the final game. There were like two entire areas cut out. I think maybe more than just two. No, I think it was two. Um, they look really cool. They were, I don't know why they cut them out. They look like a great idea. Um, I'll put the names at the bottom of the screen. I'm, screen, I'm going to describe them. Like one was like this jungly paradise almost area. Really cool looking. Um, and then there was this other one that was kind of underwater. And from the screenshot I saw, we've actually seen, like, a sprite from that area. Not a sprite. Um, a character from that area, just he wasn't used there. It's the guy who runs the uh, the minigame shop in Apodos that, uh, what is the minigame? Simon Says, the Simon Says minigame. I saw him in the screenshot for um, that other area, and it was, it was pretty cool. Uh, I will equip this on... Ah, oh, jeez. Oops. No, stop it! Oh, ah, stop it! But yeah, it was it was really cool. Let's use a fire armadillo, though. That should make a fire armadillo. And looky there, he burnt it down for us. Oh, poor thing. Oh, we it killed it. It smashed it. Oh, my. Where's it gonna go? Oh, it's not doing what I expected it to do. It, uh, it destroyed an op- Ooh, interesting. Now, that's not what I expected it to do. <laughs> but, um, you know what? It works. I really expected it to get rid of those Eye of Ra. But I can't really do anything about them. I can't re I need to get slim burbles. I need to get a bunch. So how many are out there? One, two, three, four. There are five Eye of Raw posts. Okay, so I need at least five Slim Burbles. Five more, because I'm keeping one for the museum, right? So we're gonna go down there and just grab us some Slim Burbles, which we can use to destroy those Eye of Raw. Which, actually, that that is much easier than just standing there and attacking it. It would be much, much easier. And, uh, oh, jeez, I just exploded. Okay. 
Here we go. Got a burble. Got a burble. Gonna get another one. Oh my goodness, I got one. I'm gonna go get a third one now. Oh, I missed. Let me get another one. I got one. Oh my. Let's get a fourth one. I think this is a fourth one. Oh, let's capture that. Get over here, man. My goodness. Okay, capture the monster. And I'll get one more. And I think we'll have enough then. Is that enough? Yeah, we have six now. Wonderful. That is the amount that we needed. Um, I'm gonna run over here and get some life first. Because that is what I need. Uh, no life for me. Instead, capture beetles. Wonderful, though, because we're running out. I keep using them. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, keep getting interruptions. But I will continue onward. Being softer is a loud and obnoxious. <laughs> okay. Go log piece. Click four of these and a person with the right skills will be able to increase your health capacity. I just gotta wait till everyone gets asleep and then I'll start screaming. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh. <laughs> nah. Let's keep going. I'm sorry, so many awkward pauses. I don't mean for there to be awkward pauses. Get on the platform! There we go. And we'll just fly away. With the help of our eagle friend. Flying over all these evil, maniacal eye of raw posts. Set up by who knows who. Actually, was it Anubis that set the Eye of Ra posts up? By destroying them, would that mean that we're just clearing the land of the evil Eye of Ra posts? We're basically freeing the place. What do you want me to do? Oh my goodness, I'm being quiet! <laughs> I'm gonna talk in sign language now! <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Let's go get an eye of raw post. Maybe I should talk in braille. <laughs> I don't know braille though. <laughs> okay. Let's play the game. Ew, it sounds so disgusting. It just burps. Uh, that's one. We can get another one over here. I'm sorry, there's so many moments in this episode where I'm just laughing and being stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, I, <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, I need to get more on track. I need to focus. I need to not be aware of the outer distractions of the world. Um, I really hope that gets it. There we go, yeah. Man, look at this demolition derby right here. Blowing up. Demolition derby. All right. Oh, what shot me? Okay, what pile of lies just shot me? Am I? Which one did I miss? I'm gonna go for this one over here. It looks like the safest one to get. Um, this should work. Um, yeah, blah. There we go, got that one. And then there's this one over here. This should be the final one. No, don't shoot me! Oh, man, these things are rough. How am I supposed to get to that one? Hmm, curious. I, uh, I feel like I should sneak up there somehow, but I can't really... How do I get behind that without, like, aggravating it? Oh, wait, no, there's a slope down here. Okay. Can I run up this slope? Um, oh, man. Dang it, uh... I don't know how I'm supposed to get that post. Swim. My goodness. Um, I'm stuck. I sincerely don't know what to do. Let's see. How do I get that one? wonder if I can sneak up and around. Um, climb up the sand. Will it? It's totally gonna zap me if I do that. Don't shoot me. I'm a normal person. My gosh, so rude. 
How am I supposed to get over that? Do I just use my, like, my shield? Oh my goodness. That's obnoxious. How do I get past that? Hmm. I am sincerely confused. Because I have no idea how to get past that. Block! And, oh, oh, I just had to be skillful. There we go. Ow. Oh, I hurt myself in the process, but who cares? We still got it. We got the skills, guys. We got the skills to pay the bills. Which is a song by the Beastie Boys, I think. I might be wrong on that. Um, but, yeah. Got those things. Mm, oh, man. Mm, my breath stinks. That's gross smelling. Sorry. Oh my goodness. I need to get on track. Excellent. All of the eyes of Ra are destroyed. Now my brother and I can get back to our farming. Thank you. Don't forget to come visit us, my friend. We'll help you in any way we can. Well, wonderful. Let's just run on over there now, because we're the masters of running back and forth all over the map. Thank goodness we have this Atanai, though, or else this this might have been... Th this would have taken a whole lot longer if we didn't, like, make that Aten, that Aten pad appear. Now, uh, what's this house say? Riverside Farm. Okay. Hmm. Hello again. It's great to be back on the farm with my brother again. I don't think I can thank you enough for your help. Yes, thanks to you, my brother and I can get back to our farm work. For all your help, we want you to have this. We found it while farming, but it looks very valuable. We got a canopic vase! Part of the soul of Tutankhamun is stored inside. Mmm, it looks like we're gonna go to a mummy part now. That's pretty groovy because we just acquired... What did we acquire? Stuff! We got a knop jar. Good to see you again, my friend. As promised, I've delivered the second canonic face. You look healthier than ever. Sphinx also sent something, else you might be very interested in. The Dark Stone of Invisibility. It's a magic artifact that turns you invisible whenever you activate it. However, it has one serious limitation. It can only be used when you are standing still. Start walking, you will be visible to all once more. With this new artifact, you should be able to explore and research more of this evil place. We need to find out what is going on here as soon as possible. Good luck! Well, we're back in this grossy, josie, gross hole. Let's save. Now, uh, now that we're down here, we can do some stuff. <laughs> Um, let's run on up here. Can I equip that item? Oh, no, circle! Okay, circle makes us hide. Wonderful, now we can be extra super sneaky. Now, uh, climb, thank you. <laughs> now, we just need to get back to the main area once more. Which, if I could find the way there... I think we just go the same way, don't we? Oh my, that's not what I was supposed to do. Let's get back up there. Oh my goodness, I forgot how hard platforming is. Oh my goodness, <laughs> so much land not to stand on. <sighs> okay, I know you insist on falling, mummy, but... 
uh, we can't we can't fall because that would defeat the purpose of you know uh, progressing in the game. <gasps> oh, are you kidding me? Use your little mummy arms. I'm I'm serious, man. I'm gonna make you twice as dead. No, I'm kidding. That would be horrible. And it's impossible, because he's already dead. No! You scum! I am pointing at the TV screen, getting too into it. Now, we're gonna get over there. This is a whole lot of fail right here. This is a massive amount of failage. <laughs> I just want to make it across the... You know what? I'm just gonna end the episode. This is ridiculous. <laughs> ridiculous. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna play the game properly in the next episode of Let's Play Sphinx of the Gears Mummy, where we will try not to fail as hard. Too much jumping. Bye, guys!